This is my second uh, I annotate meeting. I was there last year, and I had just joined Hypothesis uh, at the time. So I haven't been here since the beginning, but uh, I did want to share some thoughts about a uh, comparison of what I heard at this meeting versus where we were uh, a year ago. And I thought that there were several interesting themes that were emerging. One was user and user experience was very much a theme of this morning. And perhaps that was because we had some commercial players in there who very much care about this, but that annotating was a pleasant experience for people. And thinking about how people wanted to annotate, I thought, was very much present here. I didn't remember too much of that in the past. And I thought that that was a good sign. Uh, that said, um, in various discussion groups, even our annotating all knowledge and things that I saw here, especially with the sort of free text and the scribing and things, um, the kind of consumer-based or general use case and personal note-taking versus the sort of scholarly annotating use case are still very different. And I was trying to think about anchoring and, you know, cross a document equivalents where I'm scribbling on a page. And so um, the idea that there are different types of annotations and that they may not all need the same set of features is really, I think, quite clear. Um, things that have been coming up in the annotating all knowledge, for example, is discursive, uh, where you're discussing things back and forth versus authoritative annotations and whether those are one and the same. But we continue to see both types of things represented here, which I thought was good. Um, typically, I, I thought that the use cases also, as Rob Sanderson said, one needs these now and one needs these implementation use cases. And when one probes, especially on a lot of the smaller, deep sort of curatorial annotations, they still tend to be rather small, but the use cases that we were seeing from some of the panel descriptions and the Internet of Things and investigative journalism really does open the kind of uh, question of annotation uh, on a much larger scale than I had heard it considered last year. And as we saw in the panel on abuse, as we invite more and more people in, the potential of the abuse and bad things happening, not just you know the question of how to handle all these annotations, but what are people going to do with it, is now really starting to mature. And those discussions, this is, you know, we cannot wait any longer to have those discussions because it is going to come here. So again, we see annotation, uh, my experience in presenting it to my colleague, they are both very excited about it and they're very nervous about it. Um, just because of the nature of it. I thought the discussion on abuse and what have you was also, again, a very interesting one. Um, this idea of is it fundamentally different laying over somebody's content and being in their space versus talking about them behind their back. We've known that for millions of years, right? There is a very big difference between saying something in, in a, in a, inside your space and sort of talking behind back so that there are potential for conflicts there. So I thought that was also a very uh, interesting uh, discussion. Um, I thought that the presentation that we heard from Robert on where image annotation was and the sort of advancement of the standard and tools was really quite good and quite encouraging. And that I think that there really is now some momentum that is going to be uh, around annotation just because the tool set is maturing and there are things for people to use, which is why the question of interoperable annotation and what that means now is more critical than ever. And I think it's always good to hear that the people in this room in particular are very much aware that that is what our goal is. Um, and I think that was about all the different uh, thoughts that I had. Um, so uh, I did want to then open it up to the audience for any other parting thoughts that they had.